Yeah! Hola gang and welcome again to Old Nerd Reviews. I'm Tony, your Old Nerd of the Day. And I do try things so you don't have to. Today, I will be reviewing Pillsbury Bacon Toaster Scrambles. So there are four of these in a box. They also come in uh, sausage. So if, if you want to do sausage, you can do that. Back of the box says, Try delicious Pillsbury Bacon Toaster Scrambles. Uh, enjoy real crispy bacon, scrambled eggs, and melted cheese sauce in a golden flaky crust. There are two steps to making these up. First, you put them in the microwave on high for 10 to 15 seconds, and then you set your toaster to uh, low or medium, and you toast uh, one or two, well, you toast a pastry one or two cycles until it's hot or golden brown. Grab these from the uh, frozen section of Winco, and uh, oh, on the front of the box it says 25% more bacon and eggs, so obviously they've supposedly improved these. So this is what they look like. Come in a little package there, and there are four of them in there, and, and they're fairly good size. I think they could make a, a good, maybe half a breakfast, maybe whole breakfast, depending on your, your appetite, I guess. So, let's make them up. Forgot my plate. from the microwave over to the toaster. While that is toasting, I thought I'd let you know on the back of the box, very important message, it says, do not use metal objects to remove toaster pastry from toaster. We, we didn't need these kind of little, little notes on products when I was younger. People knew better. People knew that coffee was hot and that you don't use a, a blow dryer in the bathtub. <laughs> you don't put metal objects in a, a toaster that's going. That's... Oh. So after putting it through the microwave for 15 seconds, uh, went ahead and shoved it in the toaster medium, as it said, uh, did one cycle. And um, yeah, so this is what we have. There is what came out of the toaster. It's flaky, that's for sure. So we cut into it. Let's see if we can get anything just from the end. Yeah, there you go. There's the egg and the bacon inside. And there's that. Okie doke, time to give it a shot. Last look. Cut off a little bit more. Try it again. Okay, take it by the numbers. As something from Pillsbury, you would expect the crust to be flaky. It is a little bit of a crunch to it. Flaky like maybe one of those tearaway biscuits that they make. And then you've got the insides. You've got scrambled eggs. I mean, they, they don't have a lot of texture to them, but uh, they're, they're decent. Oh, actually, um, just grab a little bit of egg out of it. It does have an egg texture. It's not like gooey and stuff like that. It does have a fairly firm egg texture. I kind of just have to get around all that cheese sauce in there, but it, it, yeah, it's in there. And there seems to be a decent amount of bacon in there. It does have a decent flavor to it. A little bit of saltiness going on there. Actually, a moderate amount of saltiness going on there. And then you've got a lot of cheese sauce. Uh, the cheese sauce comes through, adds to the saltiness, but uh, all around pretty flavorful. In hindsight, I think I may want to put these through for like one and a half cycles rather than just one and and maybe get a little more brownness on the 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 crust now i would think that you would probably need two of these um to get decently filled for a breakfast so you can probably get two breakfasts 
out of the box, I'd say. All right, the damage on the Pillsbury bacon toaster scrambles. Sausage are the same. Got these over at Winco, and it was $1.98. Not bad. And taking into consideration that if you'd go out, you'd probably get a breakfast sandwich for around $3 or $2.5 or, or something like that. So if you want to stay in, um, price point is good. On the Neurometer, I would give all this puppy here, these puppies there, um... I think I would give this a middle of the road. I like it. I mean, it's it's nothing over the top, um, earth shakingly impressive, um, but it is good. Uh, it makes for a decent breakfast. Fill you up with two of them, and uh, the the flavors are are pretty nice. It's it is what it is for what it is. But would I get them again? I'm not sure. I, I thought I'd try them out, do a review with them. Not sure if I'd get them again. I, I, I think I'd like to try the sausage to see what that's like. Um, but, you know, it's, it's a quick, easy, fast breakfast if you need something like that. It, it serves its purpose. But of course, I want to know what you think. If you have had the Pillsbury Toaster Scrambles, whether you had the bacon or the sausage, let me know down in the comments what you had and what you thought. There you go, gang. Another review in the bag. Thanks so much for joining me. Uh, appreciate it. Subscribe if you haven't already. Hit me up on my social networks, on the website, on the Old Nerd Reviews 2 channel. All those links are down below in the description. And if you do all that, you too can become a part of the Old Nerd Crony community. All right, I'm going to go grab some coffee. You guys have a freaking awesome day, and I'll see you next time. Bye now.